Parametric 3D human body models are used in many applications such as 3D body reconstruction from a single image and synthetic data generation. However, existing models still represent human bodies in minimal clothing. The lack of clothing geometry leaves a gap between the body models and common images of people. In this work, we seek to augment the popular 3D simple body model with clothing. To that end, we introduce CAPE, a parametric and generative model for clothing represented as displacements from the simple body model. Together with simple, CAPE can generate humans in clothing and generalizes to different body shapes and poses. Simple starts from a template mesh and linearly adds offsets to represent different individual body shapes and pose-dependent deformations. Building upon this, we add a new clothing offset layer, which is a function of body pose theta, clothing type C, and a low-dimensional variable Z that encodes the information about the clothing structure. The clothed body is fully compatible with simple and can be reposed and animated using the same skinning function as the simple model. We represent clothing as an offset layer from the 3D body. Formally, this layer is a graph that inherits the simple topology, and the feature at each node is the offset vector from its corresponding vertex on the underlying body mesh. We parameterize this clothing layer using a novel generative graph convolutional neural network, that is, a variational autoencoder for 3D meshes. The network encodes the clothing offsets into a latent variable that we can later randomly sample. We condition the network on body pose and clothing type, making the generated examples dependent on these two factors. Furthermore, we introduce a patchwise discriminator that encourages fine structures in the generated examples. At test time, given a body pose, garment type, and random sample from the learned latent space, our model dresses up simple with a clothing offset layer. To train the network, we contribute a diverse data set of humans in various types of clothing, performing a large range of motion sequences. We register the scans to a consistent topology, and unpose them to the zero-pose space to facilitate learning. This video clip shows how the captured clothing deforms in the zero-pose during a shoulders mill sequence. We have released the data set for research purposes. The trained CAPE model has a wide range of applications. Since CAPE is a probabilistic model, we can draw random samples from the learned latent space to generate clothed bodies under different conditions. Given a pose and clothing type, we can sample the Z variable to get different clothing structures and shapes. We can also fix the Z variable and pose and compute outfits of different types but with a similar style. We can also keep both Z and clothing type fixed and vary pose. Additionally, by sampling the body shape parameter of the underlying simple body, our model generalizes to different body shapes. Also, we provide trained CAPE models for both genders. The clothing offsets generated by our model are a function of pose. In comparison, we show the traditional rig and skinning method that animates the body with fixed clothing offsets. The clothing deformations generated by our model are temporally coherent. As the clothing shape is pose-dependent, it is more visually plausible. CAPE can augment image-fitting methods and upgrade the reconstruction from undressed bodies to clothed bodies. After reconstruction, we can use our model to redress the body by sampling new garments and then bring it into animation. In summary, CAPE is a parametric and generative model for 3D clothed humans that is compatible with simple and has a wide range of applications.